I am Dolores Aranas. I am always on teacher degree. And at present, I'm the director of the Quattro Christian School, which is a, one of the ministries of Kids International Ministries. What is Quattro Christian School? The Quattro Christian School is a private school that is catering the poorest kids in the community, the orphans. We have two orphanages being catered to. And so this is a private school with more Christian kids because the kids are just, the families are just there for to be able to care. So we also provide them food, that lunch every day. Um, we give them school supplies and uh, uniforms. How did the school start? The school started in 2006. It's only started by when the plan was to just uh, have two tutorial services to the children's own kids, like the orphanage. But the director of the orphanage thought, why can't we extend this uh, uh, education to the community? And so in 2007, we started inviting first the, the children of the staff, of the children of home, to come to the school. Um, and then in 2008, we extended that to the community. Because we have seen children just running around, children who are collecting garbage. And so we, we would, I would always ask, why are you not in school? <clears throat> and the children used to say, oh, the school here is too far, we don't have money to, to go there. And so I said, why don't you come to school? And so I called the parents, the parents come and say, we would like this, your kids to be educated. And they were like, if you don't have money, because you don't really need so much money, you know, just uh, uh, bring your kids to school, prepare them to come to school, because some others would have had parents, and so we just have to like say, okay, just come. We give them a uniform. We, we 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 allow them to take a bath in our bathroom and give them soap and shampoos and towels so they can come to school. These are still sick kids. No no house. No homes at all. How have you seen kids impact the community? Let me start with my help, with my, um, the, the lady that's been helping us with, um, with my granddaughter. She said, if there is no kids, like particularly what Christian school, she has four kids. She said, they will not be able to go to school. Public school here is very hard. We have to spend like 50 pesos a day for transportation and snacks or food to go to school. Maybe our four kids going to school. We need 200 pesos a day and they don't have it. And so she said, I am so thankful to God, really thankful to God, but I am willing to serve Him because my kids were able to receive education that will not be possible if there is no CCS or the Ministry of Peace and General Services. That's one. One more. Like also in high school. She is also graduating from Virginia. I'm going to miss them. Um, her mom said, We are thankful to God that He has brought us to CCS. Because now, my husband, with the testimony of this girl, is not coming to church, he has come to the Lord, and the whole family is coming to church because of the testimony of this of this girl. I have loved the Lord so much more because of the, the passion that I have seen from these people who are helping the community.